you find the traps? I collected them all. Has he lost his mind? I believe so. Were they empty? I mean, yeah. Thankfully. Why does he use these kinds of traps? He doesn't care about the animal suffering. <laughs> Why? Do you remember the last time you were here? Yeah. It's not something that you could easily forget. Then I changed something for all three of us. What if I report Noah to the authorities? This is illegal and highly unethical. Please don't. I'm trying to help him. <laughs> what about the animals? We're helping them, too. Can we meet and talk? I would love to, River, but now's not the time. I need to get in touch with someone over the walkie-talkie, and they're not responding. Can you check one area? And uh, did you use the right code? What? You know, like, like Bond. The eagle has landed. I repeat, eagle has landed. Uh, <laughs> Mississippi River is strikingly beautiful in April. And April is a terrible month to swim in the river. Field trip has ended. And the daisies are especially ecstatic. Okay, we have to stop. I have a real issue that needs tending to. Ah, you mean the monkey is outside of the cage? Yeah, and there are no bananas. But now for real. Would you help me find Noah's son? <laughs> what? Noah has a son? Ah, or is this another code? No code. He has an eight-year-old boy named Timothy, and he is quite the handful. He's here for a week. Noah won't talk to me, and now I'm worried. Wait, was, is he by chance the kid who was screaming from the walkie-talkie? Yeah, he was pretty eager to do it once I told him I want to scare his dad. He's a great kid. Can you help me find him? Sure. Thank you. I am sending you an approximate location where I think you might be. Stranger danger! Stranger danger! Hey, I, I'm, I'm no stranger. I'm a friend of your dad and you're on April. Yeah? Prove it. Uh, well, we painted the fortress when we were young. I signed my name on the wall next to your dad's. My name's River Knox. So what? Tell my dad that I'm not coming back. Okay, sure. I just wanted to check to make sure you're safe. Hey, wait. Yes? Can you stay here a little longer? I already read all the comic books in here. Why don't you go back to your father? No. Zero. Can't. A bear might come and eat you. That's stupid. Bears are more afraid of you than you are of them. It's more likely that you're going to get struck by a lightning. It's stupid. Okay. I forgot he's the son of a hunter. Why do you refuse to leave the stand? I'm protesting hunting. I don't want fluffy foxes to die. And I think bears should eat honey and pee. I'm a vegan, you know? There's a lot to unpack here. Are you laughing at me? No, no. Uh, being vegan is great for this planet. But so is hunting. Planet? I just want to pet deer. Uh, and hug them. I don't think you should do that either. So, uh, vegan, huh? Chicken nugget. <clears throat> Don't laugh. My dad says it's not real meat anyway. Where's your mom? Probably in heaven. With the fluffy fox as my dad hunts. Oh, uh... Yeah, I bet she is great. The best. My dad told me about his friend River, and his mother also died when he was born, but he grew up to be a badass stunt double. Is that, is that you? I think so. So Noah talks about me. What else did he say? He talked a lot about you and summers you spent together with Auntie April. He made me this scavenger map with riddles to find some treasures like you used to do. But I know it's just part of this easy plan to get me to come out of here. Can I see the map? 
I'll give you the map if you make me a promise. Okay, uh, I promise. Solve all the riddles and come tell me what you found. Your dad wouldn't be happy about that. I think the riddles are meant for you. You promise. Okay, <laughs> okay, I, I will. The first riddle is in the chest below the tree. And one more thing. If you see Cinnamon Sky, don't shoot him, or I will hate you forever. Uh, Cinnamon Sky? It's my friend. Red fox with black stripes. Can you take a picture of her for me? I want to know how she's doing. Huh. That sounds like a very rare melanistic fox. Are you sure it wasn't mud? Yes, I'm sure. I've seen her a hundred times. Okay, okay. <laughs> we'll find her. See you later, Timothy. April, you there? Listening? Timothy's safe. He's hiding out in our old fortress. Oh, thank you so much. I was getting worried. You have a lot to thank me for. Listen, the only way I can reach you is by a walkie-talkie. I have to handle the disease situation with a little help of science. Wait, what do you do for a living? Are you a biological researcher? Oh, no, I'm a vet, but I have friends who test in laboratories. A vet? Wow, I, I had no idea. Well, you wouldn't, since we haven't heard from you since last summer you were here. I know everything about your stunt double career from your grandfather. Yeah, yeah he's, he's quite the fan. And, uh, I'm sorry, April. After I left the valley, my father was strict about cutting contact with everyone. Great excuse. It doesn't matter now. We have more important issues at our hands. I need you to take water samples from various drinking sources. Could you do that for me? Sure. Anything to help my grandfather's business. Thank you. Contact me from the lodge again when you are done. I will have further requests. 